Hey, are you feeling a little overwhelmed with all the knowledge and everything that's available right at your fingertips? This message is for you. Hey everybody, it's Elizabeth Morosco with Kudos Magazine, and I'm coming on here for a little bit of an apology and a little bit of insight to go along with it. Earlier today, I received a notice from Facebook that a post that we had shared from another page wasn't 100% factually true. And what the post was talking about is that if you drink tonic water, it can help provide relief to restless leg syndrome if you drink it before you go to bed. As it turns out, um, the full article did share that um, there really wasn't any scientific proof behind it. And that came from a third party that Facebook engaged and had them submit, I think, pieces of where the article came through. So with that being said, it's just a gentle reminder to, you know, double check everything that you are seeing and hearing online. And even with the content that we're sharing on Facebook, whether it's on how to check your diabetes or coping with other things while we're interviewing different professionals from different hospitals and medical institutes, always, always consult with your doctor because all of us are wired differently between health elements that we have, genetic background, you know, all of these different things have to be factored into being able to give you overall care. So I just think that it is a time that can be incredibly exciting to be able to have information right at our fingertips, but we do have to be responsible in making sure that we are not contributing to sharing fake news or fake storylines, even if it can be exciting. So we did we did go down and uh, remove that one post. Um, they didn't object to us having it up there. It was just posted as um, it, it had like a link on to onto it that it wasn't 100% accurate or something along that line. So we just removed it just so that there's never any kind of misconception. And I think it's the thing is even when it comes to case studies, people can extract one piece of a case study and it doesn't tell the full scope. And that's one of the great things about, you know, being online is being able to go and fact check um, and then even fact check the fact checkers. So it's um, it's exciting. So just enjoy the journey, but make sure that you are informing yourself continually and not just allowing social media to filter, um, you know, if something's true or not true. You know, check it yourself. It's so important, especially in this day and age. But I um, I was kind of a little bit happy that they did flag it. And then, then I did read the full entire article. Um, so it was a little bit of a misleading post. And I definitely don't want to be a part of contributing to that. I just want to make sure that this page is used as a platform to help people when they're going through a difficult time, whether it's a health crisis or a personal crisis. And often those two go hand in hand. And we really lean to experts in that industry so that we can get the raw truth and deliver it to you, whether it's through meeting with uh, dietitians at Hurley Wellness Center which they've been wonderful in sharing a lot of insight on like obesity and stopping smoking and coping with diabetes and even real life type issues that are tied into that. Like a while ago, we had done an episode that was focused on teens that have diabetes and the additional complications that they have. So through that relationship, we're able to, you know, share those little tidbits and and then of course we'd like to lean over into people that tie into like the personal development part and we've been working with Diana Fletcher who is a well-known author and speaker um and even a personal business coach so we can get those insights from her as well and share those with you so we do share a lot of personal stories and things that are tied to people that have really walked that wind and grind uh, during life's difficulties, 
And really, most of us that have survived through some sort of struggle, along the way, we were able to get expertise from other people. And that's all that we're doing here. But whenever I have anything that's brought to our attention, whether we share a uh, little snippet meme, something cutesy, um, or anything that, you know, is even bigger than that, we'll always make updates because I want to make sure that this is just a place that's filled with good vibes that has access to insight that can help with real life. All right, you guys, well, thanks so much for listening. If you got something out of this video, go ahead and share it or give us a thumbs up. And you can also find us on Facebook and Instagram at Kudos Magazine. So make sure that you go and check us out. We're always sharing good, uplifting content. So in the meantime, make sure that you make it an absolutely fantastic day. Thanks for listening.